viewers, hey subscribers, and welcome back to my channel, Accordion Empress Tarot. For those of you guys who are new to the channel, welcome to my returning Aries. Welcome back, Aries. Happy birthday, you guys, in advance. Happy birthday, happy belated birthday, if it was already a birthday. Um, so much love for you guys, okay? So let's hop right into your reading, uh, Aries. So this is a general collective reading. Okay, let me start by stating that. Um, it's general collective, so please keep in mind all the messages will not resonate with every single Aries. Y'all know the drill, okay? Please do your girl a huge favor and leave a comment down in the comment section below if the messages resonate with you, if you enjoy this reading. Leave a comment, Aries, and let me know what other readings you'd like to see done, okay? So let's hop right into it. First things first, let me light my little sage over here, y'all. Let me light my little sage and my Palo Santo over here. Because Aries, we got to clear the energy over here. Aries so we are cleaning the space all right and we're gonna just go in with a little palo santo and we're gonna clear we're gonna bring in the good energy sage cleanses out the bad palo santo brings in the positive okay so let's do it let's do it baby All right, so let's get into it, Aries. Let's get into it. All right, Spirit, what messages do you have for my Aries? What messages do you have for them? All right. Messages for the sign of Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Also, Aries, um, please check the other placements in your natal chart, such as your Moon, Rising, and Venus signs, if this reading doesn't resonate with you, okay? Make sure you hit that thumbs up and turn on your post notifications because I will be posting other readings for other signs that may be in your natal chart as well, okay? All right, so we got the spiritual help. Ask your guides. So Aries, some of you guys may want to go into prayer and meditation on some things, okay? Okay. Ask your spirit guides, ask your ancestors, that's what they're there for, connect with them, all right? We all have assigned guardian angels, so, you know, when you go through in prayer and meditation, connect with your angels and ask for guidance, right? Ask spirit for guidance. We got within a few weeks, within a few weeks, that's a time frame. So within a few weeks, Aries, some of you guys may find out some really amazing news, you may have another um, job opportunity or you may be receiving some type of bonus or raise or promotion within a few weeks. And for those of you guys who are single and watching this video, you might be receiving a little love offer. Okay, Aries. All right now, within a few weeks, Spirit said. Spirit says, strengthen your talents. Okay, so this is your green light, Aries. Um, anything that you set your mind to do, you guys are definitely like go-getters of the Zodiac. Like if you want something, you guys know how to get it done. So anything that you've been learning on how to do, just sharpen it. You know what I mean? Go ahead and finish that class. Watch, take that, watch that seminar. Get that training in. Complete your certification. Aries, you got this, boo. All right. Um. Spirit said, don't force the situation. If there's something that's kind of been weighing heavily on your mind, Aries, like whether or not you should take action in a particular situation, Spirit is just guiding you along the way saying, hey, Aries, what's going to, what's meant for you, nothing can stop it. So don't feel the need to force a situation. Just allow it to flow naturally, okay? Let's find out what's going on in your love situation, Aries. Let's, let's find out what's up with that. All right. Oh, it's 
Spirit, Divine Souls, please show me the messages for the sign of Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. What is Aries' current love situation? And then we'll get some finance messages too and close out this reading. Oh, we got Twin Flames. We have the one. Mirrored Souls are pledged. So Aries, some of you guys may have found the one. You may be with the person that you believe is the one. Take it slow because especially with twin flame energies, like as they like to call it, the chemistry is very strong, but you want to make sure that this connection can stand the test of time. Okay. Current love situation, please spirit for Aries. Sun and rising in Venus. Oh, we got Archangel Michael. Remember I told y'all your angels are guiding you, Aries. We got protection, prevented from harm and divine intervention. So some of you guys may have in the recent past, Aries, been involved with someone who was very much um, a twin flame energy. And this person may have been unhealed. So they may have been very toxic, low vibrational, and they may have been pulling you down. And spirit, for some reason, intervened to protect you from that low vibrational energy and cause you guys to go separate ways. So if this resonates with you, please drop a comment down below and let me know. Yeah, but for some of you guys, this is just spirit confirming and reiterating for you that God is watching over you, your spirit guides, your angels. They're there. They're, guard, they're guarding and protecting you daily. Okay. Tell me more. This Aries love situation, spirit. Okay. TikTok deadline time running out so some of you guys may be growing impatient with your love situation aries um if this is a current situation for those of this who's you know who this resonates with um if this person you're in a connection with like you feel like this is the one for you and you guys vibe very well your chemistry is strong there's a lot of sexual energy here, lust and sexual chemistry between you and this person. Y'all get it on quite frequently. Um, but you kind of are impatient with this person um, because you can never get Aries. <laughs> Y'all are super freaks. It says insatiable, unquenchable, and always wanting more. So who's the um who's the little sex fiend, Aries? Mm-hmm. So some of you guys can't get enough. Some of you guys have a high sex drive, Aries. <laughs> Make sure your partner can keep up with you because you don't want to be dissatisfied. Yeah, obsession. Like you can't get enough, Aries. Must have indulgence. Do you see the sweets? Do you see the sweets, Aries? Oh my goodness. Y'all are too much. We have love. Yeah, you guys love, really do love each other. There's a lot of love in this connection. Your person really adores you. I feel like you adore them too, Aries, which is beautiful energy. We got financial support, child, alimony, and government. So some of you guys may have um, recently received your taxes back or you may be about to. Some of you guys may be... Um, Filing for child support, or you may be about to file for child support. <clears throat> I feel like that's a past situation with an ex or somebody. Yeah, we got gossip, petty, jealous, envy. Um, for those of you guys who you have a child with someone that you're not currently in a relationship with, this person is extremely petty. So Spirit is saying, um, beware, because this person does not play fair, especially if you have to go to court for any reason with this person. This individual is like real petty, very envious too. It's like they don't want to see you happy. They don't really care to see that you're happy and moved on. We got crickets. Yeah. Yeah, you don't even talk to this person, but just know, Aries, that behind the scenes, they still watching you. They still watching you. Okay. All right, Spirit. What's the financial um, advice? For Aries, what we got going on here? All right. Financial messages for the sign of Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Unexpected fortune, great time to make a big purchase. Like I said, some of you guys will be receiving your taxes back in the next three weeks. Somebody's gonna be receiving them. I'm telling you. 
And you're going to be able to go ahead and make that move, purchase that car, get some things for that baby that's on the way, whatever the case may be, Aries. We got firefighter, EMT, and life savings. So some of you guys may be in the medical profession, Aries, or Spirit may be saying that may be um, the medical field may be a good profession for you to get into. We have graphic web designer business logos. So some of you guys are very good and skilled in com computer skills and computer knowledge, technologically um, advanced. Spirit also said, look, money can't always buy love or happiness. Appreciate the things you already have. So some of you guys are very abundantly blessed, Aries. So Spirit's just reminding you to show gratitude um, for the things that you have. Express that gratitude, okay? So that's been you guys' collective reading. Let's close it out with a little advice from the lover's angels in regards to your love connections. So yeah, for those of you guys who've been kind of wondering what field to go into, some of you guys may, wanted to go, may want to go into um, web design, graphic design, or into the medical field, like uh, EMT, firefighter, nurse, CNA, LPN, that type of work. All right, spirit. Ooh, we got karmic, karmic arrow, challenge, connection. Some of you guys... Just be aware that there's going to be challenges in your love situation, Aries, this month, okay? There's going to be some challenges, but y'all going to be all right. Yeah, competition, fighting, and conflict. Spirit's just letting y'all know right now, be prepared. This is Aries season, okay? It's Aries season, so be prepared for whatever happens. And trust me, a lot can happen. Yeah, we have let down, broken promises. Ooh, Aries, big, heavy energy. Um, some of y'all may feel let down by your partner, significant other, or they may feel let down by you because of the conflict and stuff. We've got sweetness. The person still loves you, though, and that's what Spirit wants you to really focus on, the fact that this person really does still love you. we got sweetness here, okay? It says adores, admires you, and this person is very affectionate towards you. Keep that in mind. Don't allow conflict to break up a healthy connection. If you pretty much have a good connection with your partner and most of the time um, it's good energy, but every once in a while y'all have a little fight, a little fight, fight, a little conflict here, y'all can get through it. Look, we got sweetness and reconciliation. Um, and I feel like the sweetness too is putting yourself in your partner's shoes, empathizing with the person and saying, if it were me, how would I feel? You know what I mean? Being considerate of one another. Being able to work through those differences, Aries, and being able to talk and communicate, you know, and then you can reconcile. Like, look, I love you, baby. See how they look? look. See how she's looking at him? And she's like, I missed you. Like, yeah. <laughs> we got daydreaming, thoughts, and wonderment. So y'all think about each other all the time. All the time. Yeah. You know what I'm hearing that song? Um i really like what you've done to me i can't really explain it i'm so into you i don't even know who sings that song but yeah like your person you and your person are so into each other aries so keep keep the love aries so that's for you guys this general collective reading for this month and for the month of april much love to you guys, Aries. If you'd like to book a personal reading, y'all got three weeks to do it. Hop on over to my website and book there. So until next time, love you guys.